God, is that Kingy? Hello, Kingy. Hello. I avoid the stream on Twitch, but I, I'm still like, I'm still thinking about like if I really care or not. If I get banned. Hello, Kingy. Honestly, honestly though, like, it's been, um, crazy. That's what I'm saying. Might just stream on Twitch and call it. Dude, I had no air conditioning in my, uh, my, um, my thing. Terrible. No air conditioning. Dude, summer. Hello, Lee Eulis. How are you doing? About to start the stream up. Um, what should I? I should play some Valorant. Um, I need to make a thumbnail for the Valorant. Always wanted to play Valorant. I'm a good Valorant player. I can carry, carry game. Let's try it. Oh hell yeah, thank you, Goombi. We can play Valorant together. Dude, I love these like late night streams because it's always chill. No doubt about it. Playing late night. So fun. I'm just playing a little bit of uh, this is game called this for rain. I'm already half up. I do. Oh, I guess I start out with half up. seeing a lot of people play this game and uh every single time i see someone play it i'm like god i gotta play this game too uh, i'm gonna pause the mute for now i've been thinking of like maybe getting into commissions and like start making people twitch chats and stuff because like i like it's so easy to make a layout like, my whole layout system is so easy. I didn't, it took me no time. And like, I feel like, I think I can do that for other people too, and do it as a, some, uh, another way of money. But, um, yeah, I, would, I definitely have to be like, deep learning how to do it. Cause like, there's a style to it, right? Like, mine's just like, kind of simple. people might be some people might mean some people might want me to do something crazy they don't mind you know yeah like so people's people like my uh my layout so you know, someone who's maybe unexperienced maybe i can do a youtube video like a tutorial 
you know, get some get some extra revenue. I haven't been pushing a lot of stuff. I haven't like pushed my Patreon. I haven't pushed all that. But I'm like subtly like trying to add it in my videos. Like recently, I'm talking about like three uh, animations, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a little bit of uh, just a little bit of shilling. You like support me with one dollar if you. Um, I mean, I'm, I'm really been back into making art again. I've I made a I made a song recently called My Building World, and uh, people like it. You guys, people said they like it. I'm I think I'm like one more song away from making an album, and then after I make an album, I'll kind of like start working on making a video game as well. Um, I think the video I'm gonna make the video game be free. Yeah, dude. I, I just been dude. Let me just tell you I When when it comes to when it comes to making music, I love it For some reason I'm, I'm all about it. And um, I don't know I take my time I just love just taking my time and just even though I'm not really good at it, like I, you know, I still try to learn here and there. It's kind of hard to get into music because you first have to like, you have to tolerate your own mistakes when you're listening to it. So it's kind of hard at first, but once you start getting into making music, um, like uh, if you listen to other people's music, you can use that to your benefit. Be like, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just treat my music like I'm an outsider. Like, I'm not gonna lie, but the new song I made, I really like my new song. Um, I can play it for. I can. I can. Um. I don't know. I don't know why my songs start with my forgiveness. Turn it up. Just. But yeah, that was my song. Really, I really love um making music. Um, I I think I'm gonna stop calling everything. I'm I'm gonna stop calling starting my uh song name because, uh, the last uh my last song, my last two songs were um one of them was my forgiveness to you, which is really cool. I might just call it it's good oh thank you i didn't 
I didn't think it was good. I thought it was just all right. A lot of people are like, the reception to it is really good. Um, I, I made a, I made like a little art piece with it. Um, the art piece is like, like a me, it was like a 3D uh, TV I made. It looked really cool. Um, I can show it on stream too. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm starting to get back to the art. And after this, I, uh, I'm going to post another, um, not another song, but just uh, post another uh, artwork of mine. But I really like the, I really like uh, what I did. I, it's like, I, for some reason, it's just like I've been appreciating my work more, my art. I think it's because of the, the way I am um, like, looking at art. Like, I'm starting to appreciate what I do. And I, I guess it's hard for a lot of people to say that or have like confidence in their own artwork. Like. It's like, I know that a lot of people can't do what I can do, and, and like, a lot of people are saying it's good, and I'm taking that, I'm not gonna take that, like, compliment with a grain of salt. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take it, and I'm gonna say thank you. So, and I, I'm gonna use it as, like, stepping stone to the next destination. Um, this looks like my YouTube video. Like, like, when someone gives me, like, critic criticism or, like, something good on it, like, like, um, my last video was, like, people said it was depressing. I was like, you know what? That, I mean, I'm not gonna lie. It, it, it kind of sounds like that. Yeah, it, you should definitely, definitely practicing always, though. Um... And it takes time. It's not like it's not like you can do it overnight. Um, a lot of people try to do it overnight, but that's like the hardest thing to do. Truly, it's hard to love something just just out of nowhere. You have to take the time. You have to take the energy, and you you have to. You have to just over, overall just think think positively more. I never I I never at the beginning of like my stage of making art I never was like yeah I'm good yeah you know I'm the best I, I can do this. No I've always was like I've always been scared and I've always been like you know uh, I don't think I want to show this to other people and I and then. Um, I kind of just never get to finish what I started, or I never get to show people my work. But um, it's, it's the fact that, you know, once you get out of that, like, zone, that mental art zone of, like, self-deprecation, self-doubt, you start to get in the zone of, like, you know what, I, I appreciate my art, and it's definitely art, you know? Once you start, like, accepting your art as art, I guess that you can say that's an achievement as well because because sometimes some people are really good at art and still don't appreciate their own art and and it's kind of baffling because you know it, like you're, you you should get to a point where you're comfortable with, like with what you do you get comfortable with how you do it. sure you might you might you, you might know your own art you, you know your own imperfections but you know your own style you know your own your own perfect lines that you made your perfect how, the, how you made it how it looked i think i think the best thing about art or one of the best things about art is that you can you can do it all with you no one can re uh, replicate. 
no one can recreate it and make it better uh, no one can recreate your style but like you know obviously you first have to get your style. I hate when people would give up with that. that's that's my uh, that's my thing. and it's kind of hard to like be there for someone and be like you know don't give up on your art and then it's like and then like you have the same problem like a lot of people face on like a lot of people uh, online face the same thing it's like it's like oh hey you know i'm i'm making art i'm gonna do this so i'm gonna do that and then have a friend that makes art and they're like you know what I hate you. Uh, I hate you. and then you know you try to you try to be there for them but at the same time you're trying to be there for yourself because you're you're making art it's kind of hard to do that be that uh be that um motivation be that uh voice of reasoning But I'm just hoping that like that more and more people are starting to get comfortable with their uh with sharing art and stuff. You know, cause it, it's not it's not easy sharing your own art because everyone's a critic. Or everyone or everyone can become a critic. Especially with music as well, that's another thing. Music is like, like I've, I've never, um, I've, I've, I've always like said that I love music and all types of music, but really it wasn't the truth until I, I understood like all different music types of different like country. I can't say I fully like music. There is some good country, but I'm not gonna just stand here and be like, you know what? I'm gonna perpetuate this lie that country is bad. No, there's you know, there's there's always that one bio in that uh, in that Discord, that Twitter, that like I love all music but country. You know what I mean? Like, uh, I think I think we can all stand. I think we could just change that line to. Um, I like, I love, I love all type of music, uh, and that's it, cause, uh, we can all, we can all see the better sides of stuff, cause there's not always, a, there's not always gonna be a good song in that one genre. Sicko mode? No, this is like, this is more than sicko mode, like, it's like sicko mode plus like, uh, Eminem and a, and a little Wayne mixed in. This is like, it's like extra sickle mode. Drake is here too. I like how you spelled sickle mode. Wait, the game is louder than me? Oh, heck. No. No. One sec. Remember when I played GeForce on this channel? I gotta revisit that game. Where is this game? I'll just make it quiet. Wait, I did make it quiet. No, I just have to make it quiet in the player. There we go. River, River City. Bam. This shouldn't be as loud anymore. All right, I should be louder than the game. The game might be a little too quiet. Isn't it?
Thank you for telling me. Thank you so much. Need to do the. I'm gonna be posting my video soon. It's gonna be done almost. Almost took me about. It, it took me too long to make that to make that video. Um, let me see what you said. Sharing art and music can be tricky. I'm not gonna lie. Um, sharing either one of them can can claim you in the criticism of hell. It it just it's like saying saying small things like oh, I like uh, Nirvana or whatever. You're, you're just like you're like oh i can already tell who you are i can already tell what you do how you like music yada yada i think it's kind of bogus i think it's kind of lame when people do that but but you know i don't i don't I, it's up to it's really it's really just the people around you i mean you can hang around people who do that And you can hang around people who like all the art like I, I've, I've seen so many iterations of like the saying this like all of it looks the same like I've heard so many times like rap is all the same k-pop is all the same country is all the same and then obviously it's like eh. is it really is it all the same like i've i've crit criticism you, you can take and some of it is not even really criticism it's just opinion or just a really bad criticism so like so like i've like i i can i it's easy to differentiate differentiate it's whatever you say however you say it it's easy to tell apart what is criticism and what's like really bad criticism and like I, I think it's clear that it's bad criticism if you generalize without evidence hell maybe they might be right i don't know honestly i just i, I just like i, I just like this I ain't really too big into uh, saying which is bad and which is good. I am so bad at getting those good guys. There we go. Sometimes my frames drop in this game, I don't know. Oh, a red? Ah, eh, that's a good red. Shut up. Also, I might just turn myself up just a tiny bit. Alright, I'm- yeah, there you go. Oh, it's because I'm on the lowest setting. <laughs> it was because I was on my lowest setting on my mic. Oopsie. Might make my game just a teeny bit loud. Yeah. Oh, that's terrible. That's a terrible mixed combo. That's a terrible combo. Holy. Hey, can you die kindly? Thank you. I like, I'm like, I love this game so much, but I'm, where's the updates for this game? Like, this game is so good that, like, it should be getting more updates, right? Am I am I just the only one thinking this? Like, 
I I love this I love this game so much, but it feels like it doesn't have a lot going for it. Like the momentum is like gone. I'm pretty sure Gearbox owns this now. And I don't know how good Gearbox is with their titles, but you know, they they got like what? Um I'm like I'm blanking out on the game titles. Um, uh, what's that one title? Borderlands, right? Like they got Borderlands, right? So like, if they got Borderlands and everything, they should be able to update this game. And and I think the console play. I think I think the console players have it worse though. Because they don't even have the void update yet. The developers like went to go work on this 2D game called Risk of Rain Forever, and it's like a reboot of the first, the first Risk of Rain. And like, I don't think it's bad and all that they're going to do it, but I, I wish that they didn't leave this game with like only one DLC. Like, I, I, I wish they kept working on this game because they have, like, there's so much more you can do in this game. It feels like there should be so much more you can do in this game. But, eh, I don't know. Maybe I'm just, that's a little, um, ungrateful. Uh, but, no, I feel like, I feel like this game, thank, but thank you to the mod community for making so much into it. Like, the mod community did so much for this. Like, I'm not gonna lie. Like, the mod community pulled through. I, I like, I, there's so much stuff you can do in this game with the mods that you, you can basically make it a whole new game. At that point. Which is not like, you know, I mean, like, it's, it's cool and all, but sometimes you wish you had the official stuff, you know what I mean? The official, the guaranteed seal of approval. I just wonder, I want to know how, like, like, how can people do it? Oh, it's really fun. Really fun. Best best game i've um ever played i i'll have you like i i'm so this game is so i i've i've loved this game since like before the uh void update and and i i've been here for like i i've been here before the void update but still like i i, I feel like this game i i like this game has came so far from from like Risk of Rain 1. Like, it is, it's truly, it's truly amazing what, what you can do with a small group of people. Like, it, it, it is crazy out here. And yeah, if you, if you, if anyone didn't know, uh, the game is made by two people or this was made by a team, but the first original game was made by two people, which is quite astounding, you know, like, like video games weren't, isn't how they were from, from like all the way back in 20, 2010, something just feels off about video games now. I don't, I don't know, I don't know what feels off about video games, but uh, like video games don't, they don't feel as promising as they used to be. And, and it's sad because I think, I think a lot of video games, 
a lot of video games used to have that title of like enjoyment you know you used to be you used to be able to get on um like left for dead or not left for dead um call of duty and you used to be like ah oh, call of duty so fun and you, dude I don't know how they made Risk of Rain into a eSport, but oh my gosh, I love it. You should go check the video out um, by um, Distort. I think, I forgot his name. I don't want to be rude and just throw out a random name. But I, somehow, some some way, they made Risk of Rain into an eSport. Oh, that's, that's also a that's also a thing I've also had problems with. Like if you just die, if you die and you, and you just you can't. There's no way if you can get back. There's just no way. You, there's like if you're in like stage like right now stage three and you died stage two, like your friend either has to give you all the chest or you know you're done. For. And I wish there was a way around that. You know what I mean? like you know like there should be some form of like mechanic or like maybe like just share items with your friends like i don't even know like i don't even know how you would fix that but but i i, I there's so much stuff you can do with this game that like it's it's boundless endless it's endless and that's what's so good about roguelikes, because roguelike, you can do anything. You can give your character a funny hat that does funny things. You can make your character go invisible, pop three times, you know, shoot a shoot a laser out of their eye, like, and then restart the run. That's what's so fun about this game. And that's why it's so good to come back to it each and every single time. But the 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 beginning thing you said it's more competitive i i genuinely don't know how the community could do that genuinely don't know how i don't know if that was a bad idea but i think it was worth Oh my god, he can still hit me while he's down there. Oh my lordy lord, bro. We're having issues. Uh, can I beat that? Okay, I didn't beat the last one, but that's that's okay. Okay, well. There's a lot more creatures here than before. Um, I think the graphics for this game is not really outdated. Like, I I want to I like I think the graphics for this game is actually like like it's it's really crazy how how like minimalistic but also like very like detailed it is. Like, like no way that that someone was just like hey let's just make a game and like let's make it feel like it's a really old game but at the same time it's new you know what i mean like it's crazy like, i feel like this game is still beautiful to this day they should add post i, I should probably get a mod that adds like post processing or something to give it even more like style If this was on Eclipse 8, I would have died there. Fall damage completely. Done for. But we're not on Eclipse 8, and we're still learning. We're on Eclipse 1 right now. Um, one of my favorite YouTubers to watch, I don't know their name off the bat, but they have like this YouTube style where like they go through all the eclipse and it's like funny moments from each eclipse they've uh, eclipse run they did 
that they they've completed and it's it's so hilarious like i genuinely love it um i, I love the content surrounding this game that's that's one of the things that i really like i love when people are just when when someone can just turn something into something small to something really big you know like 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 this is like on the same path as like team fortress 2 which i hope i i mean like i hope like one of us gets an update before like the next game comes another game title before gta 6 comes out how, how many years has it been since gta 6 came out and like and like gta 5 has been getting more updates Do you know how crazy that is you know how crazy that sounds have gta 6 come out before tf2 i need to make a bet on twitter i need to like post that as a twitter post like some we need to have a conversation about that because how is a next generation game of of rockstar gonna be like coming out while TF, team forces 2 still still kicking it live that's wild and then if if that happens where's where's gonna be risk of rain i like it's it's crazy to me genuinely it is what what is that shurikens i'll take that um but i've been watching different youtubers and stuff learn how to play this game and I learned from them and I'm like, I'm going to take your trade secrets and use them for my own purposes. I, I really, I don't like the skill, the skill, the skill gap in this game is, is, is quite astonishing to be honest. Like to, to be really skilled at this game is like something. It, it means something to be skilled in this game because in most roguelikes what you do is you you build up your masterpiece you get strong overpowered builds and you win like being skilled in 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 binding of isaac it uh it's all right like you're like being really skillful i mean like i wouldn't say it takes skill i, I get i guess it would take macro but like for for this game for for this little old game risk of rain i think it takes skill to aim takes skill to move around dodge while aiming the to what choices you do to what what you pick what you buy like like it means it, it, you have to think if you don't you know you're screwed because some some big robot's gonna like laser you in the eye. Oh, I hate these little green guys. They're really bad. It's really bad for business. I've had so many runs destroyed to them. We're close to getting that, um... Jesus, deleted. We're I think we already have enough. I'm gonna go back up there to see if I have, we have enough. Alright, let's see what's in this red chest. Okay, we don't have enough. I lied. I lied on stream. Time to make my CS go apology. Um, on the other note about um my content and stuff, I've been learning how to edit more. I've been learning how to edit, learning how to be a good editor. And it's kind of crazy that I've been editing videos for like a couple of years now and. 
and it's really it, I'm, I've been I've been coming up a long way. You know, I've been I've been making rounds, I've been making names, I've been claiming names. I I don't claim names, but you do, you get the point. I've been I've been making YouTube videos, and I hope this next video I make can like get traction. I'm preserving my game like god dang buffer. I'm just gonna do 60. Oh, that's way better. No stuttering. Is this how the game's supposed to be? I'm definitely gonna try, like, once I get my YouTube money and stuff, I'm gonna invest in my computer. I've always, I've always wanted to be a streamer, because, you know, being a streamer would be cool. I don't know, the best way to explain it to you guys is I did, being a streamer would be cool. Doing streamer stuff and being a streamer, that would be great. Not because I, I want to be like, uh, like, I don't know, because a lot of people's attentions to be streamers are really bad. But also at the same time, it's like you have to be real with yourself. And it's like, you know, it's like, it's, it's hard to explain. Ooh. But, I, you know, I... It's planning play, case, case and simple case and point. I just want to be a streamer. That'd be so fun. To to talk to other people and to know more people just because you stream is it would be such a dream to me. I don't know why though. Something about just like making people happy, like what Derma does, or like or like with just any other people. That'd be really cool. I don't think I've always wanted to be a streamer though. That's the thing. Holy moly, I'm dead. Dang you guys, I died. Well, that's a dead. Just dead. You can't do nothing about it. Before I before I uh end the stream anyway. I should do more of these like mini one off streams. I've been I've been cooking up on Twitter and uh this was the latest post I made about um about my music. And I just, I, I've been so happy about my music. All right, I've been so happy about my music. Like I've been, I've been like the most proudest person on earth about it and like how I make art and stuff. And like people were telling me like you popped off, uh, you popped off. I was really happy when when people were, enjoy, were enjoying this. So this isn't my only um. And see how it just comes back in. Favorite, my favorite part. I made it. A, I made it a loop. It. Uh, I don't. I like. I'm gonna definitely like have a moment. Where like I'm gonna start including loading screens in my YouTube videos, um, because that's gonna be cool. But um, dude, thank you guys for showing up on my stream. This video blew off. This blew this video. Everyone, everyone was talking about how they loved the video and stuff and and whatnot. 
Thank you so much. The next video is going to be about three animations. And um, yeah, that's pretty much going to be it. I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Uh, it's going to be just as detailed as this one. And I hope you guys have a good one. I love y'all. Peace.